It's rain wet streets, it's nights like this with fog rolling in, cars, faceless people going by doing the things that they're doing. There's something kind of hypnotic about it. That's when I get inspired to carry what these streets are like, what the city is like, the mysteries, the stories, the thousands and thousands of people that you pass that are going by as shadows in this wet, cold, dangerous environment. I wanted to grab that. I wanted to take it to the future. And where I took it was cyberpunk. Cyberpunk, a word that I had never heard of until I saw the original teaser trailer for Cyberpunk 2077. I was thinking just generic future stuff, you know, flying cars, robots, nothing special. After the grand finale of The Witcher 3, I was lost. I was looking forward to the upcoming news of CD Projekt Red's newest game. Only a very vague tweet and a teaser trailer is all I could go on. It was, until 2018, that I really started to see what Cyberpunk actually was. Always clear. Go! What the fuck's going on? And who the fuck is this? Good morning, Night City. Always clear. Go. Puta madre! Grab the wheel, Jack! Oh, fuck! Clear. Go. Go. <laughs> Go. Jesus Christ! My, my legs! Go. Our new high-level ability. Weapons are not dealing a lot of damage because he's packing an autonomous shield. Go. Nice. Go, 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 go. go Night go, City go, never go, stops. Go, 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 around every corner. September 18th, 2018. I've watched, exercised, slept, researched, and studied more times than I have anything else in my life. Literally trying to live and breathe this world that I don't know anything about. Ironically, wanting to live in a dystopian society filled with corporate overlords, people who talk with their guns, and rebels fighting against the system is one of the less weird things in my life. But still, I want more. This isn't enough to hold me over until the game comes out. Even though the gameplay demo came out recently, it was still pre-alpha footage, and I'm not expecting anything to be released until the year 2099, I mean 2019, or even 2020. But even though I want this game more than anything in the world, a lot of people, including myself, want this game's development to take as long as it needs. I don't want it rushed. CD Projekt Red said it perfectly. This game will be out when it's ready. But while I'm waiting for them, I'll be getting ready myself. I don't know a lot about Cyberpunk, but I do know a few things. 1. Cyberpunk 2077 is based on the pen and paper system created by Mark Pondsmith. 2. There's a bunch of Cyberpunk movies, TV shows, games, and anime that can help me learn more. Even though there are way more things I need to learn about besides things 1 and 2, I know that it is an unwritten rule of cyberpunk lore that I get a cool jacket. So here we go. First, we'll learn all we can about cyberpunk. Then we'll take our knowledge and apply it to the real world. Finally, when we can afford it, we buy and set up an ultimate cyberpunk setup, including whatever the ultimate edition of the game is full-on cyberpunk outfit, and most importantly, the setup to play the game in its purest form. This is the prologue to the beginning. Becoming a cyberpunk, getting to the starting line, getting the transfer I want, and begin the track to become a corporate god. Okay, but just for this series, I'm just gonna mainly focus on the first one. I'm going to go and do other types of videos, but right now, I'm mainly gonna focus on this. To all the people who like and subscribe to this video and channel, you are great and appreciate it in the most platonic way possible. Let me know more ways I can become a cyberpunk. Until next time, be sure to keep it casual. 